Hello, welcome to Current News. I'm your host, Chris Davis. So I'm sorry for not uploading a video last Sunday. I was meaning to, but I got super busy with another um, video job. Um, but I'm back on schedule this week. Um, today we're going to do like a recap or a review. And this is a Super Bowl 53. So I'm, I want to give you my thoughts on the Super Bowl. You probably heard a lot of sports commentators' opinions already, but I want to give you my thoughts on it. And with Super Bowl 53, my thoughts on it is that it was pretty boring, um, pretty lackluster game. We had nearly near the whole game be 3-0. to zero. And then for another longer period, 3-3, three to three, until like about the fourth quarter, um, you had the Patriots making a touchdown. So it was a very long and boring game. And what made this Super Bowl really even more boring um, was the advertisements. You know, that that's another plus side about the Super Bowl commercials. About the Super Bowl. I'm sorry, I misspoke. Um, you have these very creative, um, very well done commercials. But this year they weren't any good. Um, even the Marvel related um Commercials, the cinematic um, trailers were very lackluster. Avengers was, Captain Marvel was a little bit more interesting, but wasn't that much compared to previous Super Bowl commercials. So overall, um, the commercials this year weren't very good. Maybe Coca-Cola pulling out and other people pulling out of the Super Bowl over the... Um, standing over the flag really um, hurt the Super Bowl this time. You could really see Coca-Cola pulling out because um, you saw a lot of Pepsi commercials. But as I said, I didn't like um, the commercials this year. The commercials this year were bad. And let's talk about the halftime show because that's a really big thing. Um, I liked the halftime show. I liked um, Adam Levine's song selection. He played a, a lot of old songs, um, but they were but they were really good. Um, he also played some of his more relevant stuff, but I liked how he played some of his older music. I thought it was really good. I think the only thing he lacked was energy. Um, it, people who I talked to, they said that the halftime show was lackluster. So he didn't have his energy. He didn't have enough energy on the stage. And that's what I saw when I was watching it. But his song selection and how he sang uh, was really good. Um, you had Travis Scott there and he pretty much brought the energy. And then you had another um, famous rap star. I can't think of his name right now. Um, he had some energy. Not as much as Travis Scott though. Um, but I think Adam Levine should have had more energy um, in the Super Bowl halftime show. Um, now that I've t we've talked about the Super Bowl, it was boring, ads were boring. The only decent part about it was the halftime show, um, which could have used more energy. Like the song selection, though, I want to talk about is what I want to talk about now is is Tom Brady going to retire or should he retire is Ro is Gronkowski is he going to um retire um let's deal with Tom Brady first um Tom Brady should he retire um I'm thinking why would he not retire he has six Super Bowl rings now he's like the Michael Jordan of football. I'm. I mean, he's like 41, 42, um, like past his prime. Granted, he he won a Super Bowl this year, but when it comes to things like this with your career, it's better off you leaving out on on a leaving out strong than you leaving and people are trying to push you out. So I think. Just for his career, um, he should just like go ahead and retire. He has six Super Bowl rings. He has uh, more than like anyone else now, so he should. Um, now with Gronkowski, should Gronkowski retire? Um, I've been hearing this for months, saying that 
he wants to retire from football. He wants to retire from football. And mainly it's because he gets beat up a lot. And my thing with Gronkowski is I think the reason why he feels beat up so much is that he never takes a day off. He never rests. So, like, what I'm talking about is, like, after he plays, like, a game, he wants to go out there and have fun and party. But my thing is he needs to take a rest, um, not just so his body can heal, but just so he, he can heal mentally. So, you know, when you do one thing after another, you get burned out. So what he needs to do is just rest and not have this phobia of missing out. Like, oh, if I don't go to this party, if I don't go to this function, I'm going to miss out. I mean, it's okay if you miss uh, a few functions and a few parties now and then. If you need a rest so you can still play at your A game, then just do that. You may not be able to go as to as many parties or to as many functions as you like, but just so you don't get burned out mentally or just so your body can heal, you should just rest. And I think if he does that, he can still play a lot longer. But it's his career. If he wants to retire, he, he can retire if he, if he if he feels like he needs to. Um, so that's all we have for today. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Did you want to watch the Super Bowl this year? Did you like it? Did you not like it? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Also, follow me on social media. I have the links in the description box below. And all of you, have a great day.